Hey guys, Ralph here. Welcome to True Power Weight Loss Center and Vintage Sunday. As you know, if you've been watch yesterday, uh, the weekends I don't usually post anything, but now I'm just going to post things from other uh, from other sources that I really like. And one of my favorite of all time was Joe Rogan and Chris Kresser getting destroyed by Game Changer producer James Wilkes. It's just hilarious. So bad that Joe Rogan and Chris Kresser deleted the video from their from their uh, websites. Just deleted. They got killed. Now what happened is when the game the the video the game changers came out. And if you haven't seen it, I strongly suggest you check it out. They the, these two clucks, morons. First of all, I don't watch a lot of Joe Rogan. I don't. I I don't think he's a very bright man. You know, he gets in some nice topics, but he gets into a certain point, and if he happens to be losing or he can't think anymore, uh, out comes the F word, out comes the joint. It, it, it's just nonsense, and I, I won't. Every once in a while, he gets a, um, a, uh, a guest on there that I find interesting, Candace Owens or Ben Shapiro or something like that. But this one, when they started, they were just so... When they, and Chris Kresser is a paleo tool. He's an acupuncturist that doesn't know a darn thing about what he's talking about. Nothing, as you'll see, okay? Now, anybody that knows anything. Now, acupuncturist, say what you want about me, but I have a PhD in nutrition, okay? You don't have to agree with it, I don't care, but I know what I'm talking about. And if you don't want to adhere to it, fine. But don't just lie. That's the thing, Kresser, and that's how he talks. Chris Kresser just lies. Oh, he, it's a lie. I'm telling you this paleo keto is a lie. I've been telling you that for a long time. And everybody said, yeah, Ralph. Yeah, Ralph. We know you don't like it. No, blah, blah, blah. No, it's lying. And by people that have no idea what they're talking about. Anyway, they crucified. Rogan and Kresser by themselves did a podcast, crucified the game changers. Just obliterated them. A couple months later, the guy that produced it, James Wilkes, came back and did a rebuttal for Rogan and Kresser. Okay? Now, you can't get the whole... Oh, it was a massacre. Massacre. Wilkes killed him. Chris Kresser admitting, not knowing how to read scientific literature, lying, not... Have, he admitted it. Yes, I, I, I misspoke. Blah, 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 blah. They just make things up. And this was one of the most glorious, glorious takedowns ever. Now, I wish you could see the hour-long thing. It was just a massacre. But again, they've taken it down, as well they should. I would too. And all you get is these little compilations here and there. And here is a very, very good one down below. Check it out. And the thing, the thing about Cresser, even after all this, if you go back on his website, he hasn't done anything anything to stop spewing these lies. And that's what he are. He, he is a liar. Joe Rogan, he's adult. <laughs> he doesn't know what he's talking about. He's a hopeless drug addict. Marijuana, caffeine, coffee every day, booze. They're both, they're both drugs. Steroids. His face is so bloated with inflammation. Why anybody would take this guy seriously is beyond me. But that's beautiful. Beautiful, beauty of the land that we live in. But Kresser, health practitioner, he's an acupuncturist. He took a six-month course. Please, he doesn't know a thing about what he's talking about. And he hasn't changed one bit since this debacle, where he admitted he lied, didn't know what he's talking about, misspoke. James Wilkes killed him. Killed him. Anyway, I think you'll enjoy it. Down below, eat and drink your fruits and vegetables and your starches and live your life with true power. Love you all.